Alhamdulillah, Alhamdulillahi Rabbil Alameen, wa salatu wa salamu ala nabiyyina Muhammadin, wa ala alihi wa ashabihi wa azwajihi ajma'in. Amma ba'd fa'awdhu billahi minash shaitan rajim, bismillahi rahman rahim. Rabbish rahli sadri, wa yasir li amri, wa ahlu luktatam min lisani yafqahu kawli. Rabbi zidni ilman ajma'in insha'Allah. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala increase in all of us knowledge. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuhu. Well, we will start today lesson number 11. And before that, we'll do a little practice. Adarsul Hadi Ashara. Adarsul Hadi Ashara. Let us first do quickly our brothers and sisters. Damirun munfasilun. Ready? Huwa huma hum. Hiya huma hunna. Anta antuma antum. Anti antuma antunna. Ana nahnu. Huwa huma hum. Hiya huma hunna. Anta antuma antum. Anti antuma antunna. Anna Nahnu. One more time. Hua Huma Hum. Hia Huma Hunna. Anta Antuma Antum. Anti Antuma Antunna. Anna Nahnu. I hope by now you have memorized it. Right? It's right there in, in your mind, inshallah. Huh? And we follow the same sequence, brother. Let us do Madi quickly. Darasa. Darasa. Darasu. Darasat. Darasata, Darasna, Darasta, Darastuma, Darastum, Darasti, Darastuma, Darastunna, Darastu, Darasna. Huh? Okay, mashallah. Let's do Sakana also. Madi, Sakana, Sakana, Sakanu, Sakanat, Sakanata, Sakanna, Sakanta, Sakantuma, Sakantum, Sakanti, Sakantuma, Sakantunna, Sakantu, Sakanna. 
What is the meaning of darsa? He studied. Huh? He studied. Studied. He studied. Huh? And then what is the meaning of sakana? He lived. He lived. Huh? Now they are both bab nasara. So darasa will become yad rusu. Sakana will become yas kunu. Yad rusu means he studies. Yaskunu means he lives. Okay? Let us do it now, brother and sister. Yadrusu, Yadrusani, Yadrusuna, Hia, Tadrusu, Tadrusani, Hunna, Yadrusuna, Anta, Tadrusu, Tadrusani, Tadrusuna, Anti, Tadrusina, Tadrusani, Antunna, Tadrusna, Ana, Adrusu, Nahnu, Nadrusu. Masha'Allah. Okay? So, brothers and sisters, if I say Hua, it will be Yadrusu. Hiya, Tadrusu. Muhammadun, Yadrusu. Aminatu, Tadrusu. Ana, Adrusu. Nahnu, Nadrusu. Anta, Tadrusu. Anta, Tadrusu. Anti, Tadrusina. That is very important. Anti, Tadrusina. Antum, Tadrusuna. Hum, Yadrusuna. Atullabu, Yadrusuna. Atullabu, Yadrusuna. Al Auladu, Yadrusuna. Hia, Tadrusu. Hia, Tadrusu. Hunna, Yadrusna. Atalibatu, Yadrusna. 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 You will, inshallah, watch for it. Are you with me? Now let's do Yaskunu. Okay? Yaskunu. Yaskunani. Yaskununa. Hia. Taskunu. Taskunani. Hunna. Yaskunna. Anta. Taskunu. Taskunani. Taskuni. Nuna. Anti. Taskunina. Taskunani. Antunna. Taskunna. Ana. Askunu. Nahnu. Naskunu. Nahnu. Naskunu. Now you know all these words will come inshallah. And you will be able to understand with ease inshallah. Huh? Okay brothers and sisters. Huwa. Yaskunu. Huwa yaskunu. Hiya taskunu. Hamidun yaskunu. Fatimatu taskunu. Ana askunu. Anta taskunu. Anti taskunina. Anti taskunina. Antum taskununa. Antum taskununa. Al auladu. Yaskununa At-tullabu Yaskununa Ar-rijalu Yaskununa Antunna Taskunna Antunna Taskunna Hunna Yaskunna Hunna Yaskunna At-talibatu Yaskunna At-tullabu Yaskununa At-tullabu Yaskununa Anta taskunu. Antum taskununa. Ana askunu. Nahnu taskunu. And finally, anti taskunina. Anti taskunina. Inshallah. Keep that in mind, brothers and sisters. Now we start our lesson. Okay. Filha filati. What is the meaning of filha filati? In the bus. Huh? In the bus. You know, in the bus, there are many passengers. One person is asking the other person some questions. The first person is asking. So he starts the conversation with, Assalamu alaikum. Are you with me? What is the second person replying with? 
وعليكم السلام ورحمة الله وبركاته. Then the first person is asking, Masmuka ya akhi. What is the translation? What is your name, O oh brother? The person is answering, Ismi Abdullah. Are you with me? Ismi Abdullah. In other words, the number two person is Abdullah. Okay? And number one person is Faisal. Huh? So, besides Al Awwalu, you can write down Faisal. Huh? And besides Thani, you can write down Abdullah. Just to make things even more easier, you know. So Abdullah says, Ismi Abdullahi. Huh? Just to refresh your memory. Ismi Abdullahi. What is Ismi? How many words are there? Two. Abdullahi. How many words are there? Two. Abdullahi. Two. Huh? Abdullahi. No, they are both compounds. What kind of a compound is Ismi? Mudaf Mudafili. What kind of a compound is Abdullahi? Mudaf Mudafili. Is it Jumla Felia or Jumla Ismiya? Jumla Ismiya. So what are we looking here? Muftada. Muftada. Where is our Muftada? Ismu. Wahua Mudaf. And Ya Mutakallam? Mudafili. Where is our Khabar? Abdu. Abdu is our Khabar. Wahua Mudaf and Mudafili. Mashallah, it is fresh in your mind. Well, Masmuka, what is the translation? And what is your name? Ismi Faisalun. Now again, Ismi is Mudaf Mudafili. Our Muptada is Ismu, Bahuwa Mudaf, Ya Mutakallim, Mudafilihi. And what, where is the Khabar? Faisalun. Atalibun Anta Ya Abdullah. Ya Abdullah. Remember. Atalibul anta ya Abdullah. Why ya Abdullah? And not ya Abdullah? Yes, you see. Ya is a harfu nida. Huh? And if the monada happens to be a mudaf, then it becomes mansub. Huh? See, Abdullah is a compound. Mudaf, mudaf ilayhi. So when you use it with harfu nida, then abdu becomes abda. Uh, the mudaf becomes mansub. Uh, Muhammadun ya Muhammadu. Aminatu ya Aminatu. Abdullahi ya Abdullahi. Uh, Abu Bakrin ya Aba Bakrin. Uh, yeah, inshallah we'll remember this. Uh. Atalibun anta ya Abdullah. Naam. Now the question comes, Aina tadrusu yaakhi? Huh? Aina tadrusu yaakhi? Huh? Because he is asking someone in front of him. What is the translation? Where do you study? Huh? Ya Abdullah? Tadrusu. How will I analyze it? Fialun, mudariun, marfun bi dhamma. Huh? Marfu on bi dhamma. Are you with me? Maybe I should write down. Huh? Okay. Do you all have the keys for book two? From now onwards. You must always bring the key, huh? because I will be able to then uh, read some parts of the key. Because the explanation that Dr. Abdurrahim gives is the most precise and the most beautiful. Okay, nobody can make a better explanation than Dr. Abdurrahim himself. And I would request you, brothers and sisters, that you should have now the old set. Remember the old set, blue book, orange book, and green book. If you don't have it, please buy it. And that's the key. Huh? Because soon we'll be going in book three, then there are no new books for book three. The old books are what we'll be studying. Huh? So if you don't have them, please buy them. Huh? They are available 
six books for twelve dollars, you cannot go wrong. Now, brothers and sisters, what I wrote on the board, okay, that will apply, that will apply to, the first thing will apply to five in the pocket. Are you with me? If I say Darasa and then go to Yadrusu, five in your pocket, what will be? Yadrusu, Tadrusu, Tadrusu, Adrusu, Nadrusu. Now, in all of these five, your explanation will be Fialon, Vadarion, Marfon, Bidamma. Huh? In all of these five, which is five in your pocket. The second section, what is the second section? Noon aata hai, noon jata hai. How will you define that from grammar point of view? You will say, if you see the noon, you will say, Fialun, Mudarun, Marfun, Bi, Thubuti noon. What is the Thubuti noon means? It is Marfu with the presence of noon. What will you write down? Presence of noon. Be thubuti noon. Presence. Huh? By the presence of noon. Huh? Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Now, there will be certain sentences of grammar. You will memorize it. It will automatically be memorized. Huh? And then that's all you use it all the time. So it's very easy. Huh? So when it's five in the pocket, your explanation is Fialun, Mudharyun, Marfun, Bidamma. And when it is Noon Aata Hai, Noon Jata Hai, what is your explanation? Fialun, Mudharyun, Marfun, Bi Thubuti Noon. It's Marfu. How do you know it is Marfu? By the presence of the Noon. Are you with me? It's very easy. Inshallah. Keep that in mind. So here, Aina Tadrusu Yahi, where do you study, O oh brother? Tadrusu, Fialun, Mudarion, Marfun, Bidamma. And where is the file? Damirun, Mustatirun. Takdiruhu, Anta. Takdiruhu, Anta. Very good. What is the answer of Abdullah? Adrusu. What is the meaning of Adrusu? I study. Okay, brother, Adrusu, how will you define Adrusu? Fialun, Madarion, Marfun, Bidamma. And where is the file? Damirun, Mustatirun, Takdiruhu, Ana. Sahi? So it's very simple. And you will love to say it, inshallah. Adrusu bi Jamiati Riyad. I study the University of Riyadh. Bi Jamiati Riyadh. How many words are there? Three. B, Harchar, Jamiati, Isam Majur, Wahuwa, Mudaf, and then Mudafilihi. Very good. Now look at this next sentence, brother. Ayu has come. But before Ayu, there is a Harfjar. So what will you say? Fi Ayji. Fi Ayji Kulliyatin. These three words are coming in a sequence. Okay. And how will you define it? Fi Harfshar Ayji Isam Majrur. Wahua Mudaf and Kulliyatin Mudafile. Remember, we studied Ayyu will always come as a Mudaf. So if Fi comes, then because of the Fi, Ayyu became Ayyi, Majroor. But it, it is still Mudaf. And there will be Mudaf Ilihi after it. Fi Ayyi Kulliyatin Tadrusu. How will you translate? In which faculty do you study? You are studying. What is the answer? Adrusu Fi Kulliyatil Handasati. Fi harfjar kulliyati isam majroor wa huwa mudaf and handasati mudafili. How will you translate? In the faculty of engineering. In the faculty of 
engineering. Huh? You should be fine. Fi ayyi sanatin. How will you translate this? In which year? Huh? In which year are you studying? Fi ayyi sanatin tadrusu. Now remember, brothers and sisters, tadrusu, we analyzed it. So there should not be any problem. Tadrusu, fialun, mudariun, marfun, bidamma. Where is the file? Mustatir. Takdiruhu, anta. Adrusu, takdiruhu, ana. Nadrusu, nadrusu, nahnu. Takdiruhu, nahnu. And if I say tadrusu for a lady, then takdiruhu, here. If I say yadrusu, takdiruhu, huwa. Adrusu fi sanatathaniyati. I study in the second year. Huh? Correct, brother? I study in the second year. Atariful muhandisa salmana. Atarifu. Do you know the engineer Salman? Okay, brothers. Atarifu. Arafa ya'arifu. What Bob will this be? Arafa Yarifu? Bab Daraba. Daraba Yadribu. Huh? Okay. Arafa Yarifu. Are you with me? Arafa Yarifu. So this is Bab Daraba. Huh? Keep that in mind. Always, you know. What is the meaning of Tarifu? Do you know? Okay. Know what? Al Muhandisa. So mafulun bihi. Huh? Know what? The question applies. Huh? Fine, brother and sister. Ta'arifu. Fialun, mudariun, marfun bi. Dhamma. Fahil. Mustatir. Takdiru. Anta. See, it is the same thing you keep on saying. If you have to analyze. But we are not going to analyze every sentence. At random, we'll pick up sentences and analyze, inshallah. So, Mohandisa, what is Mohandisa? Mafulunbi. And what is this Salman doing here? It's Badal. <laughs> you immediately can recognize it is Badal for Mohandis. Tab'an. Huh? Tab'an. Are you with me? Tab'an. What is the meaning of Tab'an? Of course. Of course. Is Tab'an Marfu, Mansub, Majroor? Why? There has to be a reason. What is the reason? Taban. Mafulun Mutlak. What is it? Mafulun. Just write down Mafulun Mutlak. When we study inshallah in detail, you'll understand it fully inshallah. Huwa Ustadi. Ustadi. How many words are there? Two. Mudaf, Mudafili. So Huwa Muftada, where is Khabar? Ustazu. Bahuwa mudaf, and ya mutakallam mudafili. Huwa, again muftada. Ahsanu mudarrisin. Where is our khabar? Ahsanu. Bahuwa mudaf. And mudarrisin, mudafili, fil kulliyati, jar majru. What is the translation? Huwa, ahsanu mudarrisin, fil kulliyati. He is the best. Superlative degree. He is the best teacher in the faculty. Man haulail fityatul ladina maaka. See, man haulail fityatul ladina maaka. This is a question. We are not going to analyze. But we will translate. Man haulail fityatul ladina maaka. What is the translation? Who are those young people who are with you? Huh? Fine. Ka'annahum ikhwatuka. Huh? It seems that they are your brother. Okay? Ka'anna. What is ka'anna? Huh? Min akhwatu inna. Fine, brother and sister. So what is whom here? Ismu ka'anna mansubun. Are you with me? Where is Khabar Ka'anna? Ikhwatu. Wa huwa mudaf. 
المضاف إليه إخوتك إخوتك مضاف مضاف إليه كارد أيدي أبداً سيستر إن شاء الله نعم هؤلاء إخوتي How many words are equity? Two. Mudaf, mudafili. Where is our mubtada? Haulai. Where is our khabar? Ikhwatu. Wa huwa mudaf, ya mutakalam, mudafili. Li, char majur. How many words are there? Two. Char majur. Li harf char. And isam majur is? Ya mutakalam. Li, arbaatu ikhwatin. Li, arbaatu ikhwatin. Li, Arbaatu ikhwatin. So li is jar majur shibu jumla khabar. And then arbaatu is your mubtada wa huwa mudaf and mudaf ilayhi. Then ataf comes wow, wa. Okay. And then brothers and sisters, salasu. What is salasu? Huh? What is salasu? Mautufun. What is salasu? Mautufun. Salasu is Mautufun. Ala Arbatu. Hmm? And Akhwatin is Mudaf ilayhi. Aina Yadrusu Haulai. Aina Yadrusu Haulai. Brothers and sisters, Yadrusu has come. Look at the sentence very carefully. Yadrusu. Fi'alu mudariun marfun bidamma. Where is the file? Where is the file? Haulai is your file. Haulai is your file. Huh? Okay? Haulai is your file. Translation. Where are these studying? Yeah? Fine. Now here comes Amma. There is a detailed explanation of Amma. Okay, there is a detailed explanation of Amma coming later on. But Amma means as far. Okay. We will learn more about Amma in book 3. It's a particle of shart. It's a particle of condition. A particle of condition. But those things will come in book 3. Even if you write down it's a particle of condition, you have no clue what condition is. These are the things we will study in book 3. But for now, it is important to understand that after Amma, Muftada will come. Are you with, with me? Muftada will come. And then we have to have a Khabar. And when Khabar comes, it is always comes with fa. I would like you to highlight it when you come to sentences like this. Huh? So what is amma, when you say amma, then it means you are asking about more than one thing. And then you want to ask about more than one thing, and then you want to describe them one by one, and then you will say as far in English. Huh? Who are these two, you will say? Who are these two, you will say? As for this one, he is this. As for that one, he is that. Are you with me? So you are, in English, we use as far. Are you with me? We are using as far. As we discuss, Amma will be followed by Bhuptara. And then you will have Khabar. But before Khabar, Fa will come. Now this, we'll learn more with practice. When you'll write it, and then you'll see how you are using fa after amma. Amma means as far. Huh? Fine. Amma ikhwati. How will you translate? As far, my brothers. Huh? And then the, the jawab comes. I mean... The khabar comes. Are you with me? The khabar comes. And khabar will start with fa. Fa kulluhum. 
What is the meaning of kulluhum? All of them. What kind of a murakab is this? Compound is this? Kulluhum. Mudaf, mudaf ilahi. Mudaf, mudaf ilahi. Huh? Amma ikhwati, as for my brothers, all of them. In English, you know, we will say, as for my brothers, they are studying. All of them are studying. Are you with me? Amma ikhwati, fa kulluhum yadrusuna. Kulluhum yadrusuna. Are you with me, brother? What is the meaning of yadrusuna? They are studying. Remember, huh? how will you define yadrusuna? Fialun, mudharyun, marfun, bi thubuti nun. Huh? Inshallah, when you will say for about six times, you will become expert. Fialun, mudharyun, marfun, bi thubuti nun. And where is your file? Alwa. Alwa is your file. Bil jamiati. So how will you translate this? Amma. Ikhwati, all of them are studying in the university. Or Isa, okay, brother. What about Isa? Wahua akbaru minni. Isa, and he is older than me. Mashallah. You know akbaru, it is a smooth of deal. Min came, it is comparative degree. He is older than me. Yadrusu. Fialun mudhariun marfun bi dhamma fail mustatir takdiruhu huwa. Takdiruhu huwa. Yadrusu fi kuliyati tibbi. What is the meaning of fi kuliyati tibbi? Faculty of medicine. Wa Ibrahimu. What is Ibrahimu, brother? Muftada. Where is the khabar? Yadrusu, jumla failure. Yadrusu fi kulliyati tijarati. He is studying in the faculty of commerce. So, how will you now here define Yadrusu? Fialun mudariun marfun bi dhamma fail mustatir takdiruhu huwa. But remember five in your pocket, which comes for huwa, hiya, anta, ana, nahnu. And in most of them, the file will be mustatir. Especially in Anta, Ana, Nahnu, file is always Mustatir in Mudariya. Hua and Hia, maybe. Mustatir may be maujood in the sentence. We will be watching for it, inshallah. Okay. Wa Ishaqu and Ishaq yadrusu fi kulyatil adabi. What is the kulyatil adabi? Faculty of art. Huh? Faculty of art. Wa Ismailu Yadrusu fi Kulyatil Ulumi. Brothers and sisters, what is Kulyatil Ulumi? Faculty of science. Science. Waha Ulai Salasatu Asgaru Minni. How will you translate this? And these three. Yeah, you're younger than me. Huh? So, what will you call how will I? Muftada. Muftada. Huh? Okay. And what will you call Salasatu? Badal. <laughs> Badal. And where is the khabar? Asgaru. Huh? Huh? Minni jaan majur. Fine. Amma. Again, Amma. As for. Ammal akhwatu. As for the sisters, as for the sisters. So, akhawatu, brother and sister, is your muqtada. Okay? And where is the khabar? Fayad rusna. Fil madrasatil mutawasitati. How will you translate this, brother? As for the sisters, they are studying in the middle school, intermediate school. Huh? Yad Rusna has come for the first time. Okay? Yad Rusna, how will you define Yad Rusna? Remember, I told you, three sections in Mudarya. Five in your pocket, Noon Aata Hai, Noon Jata Hai, and then Mabni. So what will you say here? Yad Rusna, Fialun, 
mudhariun ha mabniun ala sukun ha mabniun ala sukun ha remember i yesterday wrote it down ha yadrusnu is fialun mudhariun mabniun ala sukun okay there is still more to define but i won't go in detail brother are you with me shall i write it down okay hmm? this explanation is not complete ha huh, brother ja what is the proper uh, arabic uh, Uh, they are no 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 this is for our understanding only yes. the proper thing is the this group of noon aata hai noon jata hai is called al afwal al khamsa five special verbs you know brother abdul samad i want to explain you things uh, uh, in a way that becomes easy for you and then what will happen that when we come to the real thing you will have no problem yes. so in understanding understand. understanding is here yeah. understanding okay is it's called al afwal al khamsa these are the five special verbs uh, what is their speciality noon aata hai noon jata hai that is their speciality are you with me and that we will also have al asmaul al khamsa five special noun in which the rules are different when they become mudaf we have studied only so far alabu and alahu ha huh? ahu and abu we have studied okay but i am introducing these rules to you little bit in advance ha huh? so that when the real thing will come you know you have no difficulty inshallah huh? so If it is mabni ala sukun, where is the file? Ya drusna, where is the file? Noon is the file. Huh? This is your nunu for the ladies. Nunu is your file. Hmm? Nunu niswa, you can say if you want to. Okay. Zay nabu. See now, third person, feminine. singular zainabu tadrusu how will you define tadrusu be careful na brother fa'un mudhari'un marfu'un bi dhamma where is the file dhamirun mustatirun taqdiruhu hiya huh? that is what you have to understand huh? when you define these five in your pocket you have to define the taqdir of those uh, pronouns you know zainabu tadrusu fi sanatil ula uh, what is the meaning of it <laughs> studies in the first year was <laughs> salma so well, zainab is your muftada and khabar is your jumla failure sahi was <laughs> salma tadrusu fi sanatil thaniyati can you translate this and salma studies in the second year wal laila tadrusu fi sanati salisati and the laila studies in the third year and laila studies in the third year fi ayyi madrasatin tadrusu akhwatuka remember and there is a verb there is a file so we must scrutinize the sentence and see if we can find the file fi ayyi madrasatin in which school tadrusu fi'l mudhari'a marfu bidama now where is the file ma sha allah now what did you say about the samad so only akhwatu <laughs> mashallah if we say akhwatuka no that is mudaf mudaf mashallah that was excellent ha huh? ha huh? mashallah akhwatu is your file wa huwa mudaf and then mudaf ilahi hmm? 
Fine. <clears throat> what is the answer now? Yadrusna. How will you define Yadrusna? And how will you translate Yadrusna? No, how will you translate? They are studying. Huh? What is it? They, feminine, all of them feminine. She, with the sentence we will be able to figure out. Okay? It, if it is Tadrusna, means Antunna. If it is Yadrusna, means Hunna, they. Yadrusna, fi madrasati, Khalid ibn al Walid, lil banat, bi makkata. How will you translate now? They are studying in the school, Khalid ibn Walid, lil banat, for girls, bi makkah, in makkah, mashallah. So, yad rusna, this is jumla failure. How will you define yad rusna, brothers and sisters? Failun, mudaryun, mabniun ala sukun. <coughs> what will you say? Mabniun ala sukun. And where is the file? Noon, mashallah. <coughs> Now he is asking another question. Aina taskununa antum. Aina taskununa antum. Okay, what is the translation? All. Where do you all live? Huh? Fine, brother. Taskununa. How will you define taskununa? Fealun, mudharyun, marfun. Be thubuti noon. Are you with me? Be thubuti noon. And where is the file? Wow. And what does wow signify? Antum. Huh? Brothers and sisters, the question says, Aina taskununa antum. If there was no antum there, and if there was only Aina taskununa, what would have been the translation? Where do you live? So why this antum has come? For emphasizing. Huh? For emphasizing. Huh? This, this noun is used for emphasizing. Ikhwati. Brothers and sisters. What is the meaning of Ikhwati? Ikhwati. My brothers. Okay. Ikhwati. Two words. Mudaf, mudaf ilihi. And Ikhwatu is your Mubtada wa huwa mudaf, mudaf ilihi. And where is the khabar? Yaskununa. Do you see now the verbs are coming in all forms? Eh? And we know it, inshallah. What is yaskununa? Fialun, mudaharyun, marfuun, bi thubuti nun. Where is the file? Wow. What does it represent? Day. Eh? Remember, taskununa. The vow will represent antum. And when you say yaskununa, the vow will represent hum. Are you with me? Hmm? Yaskununa fi mahajir. Mahajir jamiati in the hostels of jamia. Amma ana, how will you translate that, brother? As for I. Huh? As for I. So, I, Ana, is your Muftada. Huh? Where is the Khabar? Fa askunu. So, do you see Fa has come? But wherever Amma comes, you should highlight Amma and Fa. Hmm? Before also, we, we start again from the middle of the page. Amma ikhwati fa kulluhum. Highlight fa. Are you with me? I think you highlighted it. Huh? Where is the next time Amma comes? Yeah. Amma akhwati fa yadrusna. So fa again highlighted. Do something so that when you are revising your lesson, it becomes very prominent uh, for you. Okay, brothers and sisters? And then again here comes. Amma huh? ana. And where is the khabar coming? Askunu. So fa will come here. Huh? Fa askunu. What is the meaning of fa askunu? 
I live. Askunu, okay, brother and sister, fielun, mudarion, mafun, bidamma. Where is the fire? Damirun, mustatirun. Takdiruhu, ana. But then, here you should remember, huh? Who, huh? Here, in these two cases, the file can be mustatir or file can be maljud. Are you with me? Huh? Al failu. Okay. Musta tirun or it can be mauju dun. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Both possibilities will be present in the sentence. And you will have to figure out. Okay? Now in the case of Anta Ana and Nahnu Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Inshallah, you remember this. Huh? We are talking about five in the pocket. Okay? When it comes to hua and hia, two possibilities. Do you understand? And we are talking about those five forms of fail mudarya, which we call it Jokingly, five in your pocket. Huh? Are you with me? So, out of those five, who and he have formed, the file can be mustatir, file can be moju. So, before you jump to the conclusion, read the sentence. Okay? But as far as anta, ana, nahnu, they are always mustatir. Always, always mustatir. They are mustatir. Okay, brother? Amma ana fa askunu. So askunu is felun, mudarion, marfun bi dhamma, al failu, damirun, mustatirun, takdiruhu, ana. Fa ana askunu ma'a karibin li. What is the meaning of karibun? Means relative. Uh, in this case, relative. Uh, now, we will learn a little more in the dars. The exercises are coming. When you say karibun li, it means I am staying or living with a relative of mine. With a relative of mine. In other words, you have many relatives and you are staying with one of your relatives. Huh? Are you with me, brother? We are going to study this in detail later on in the lesson. Now, I don't want to go in too much detail now. Let us just try to understand, brother. Ma'a, what is ma'a? Is a zarf. Sahi. And what is kari bin? Mudafilehi. And what is li? Jah majur. How will you translate? As far I, I live with a relative of mine. A relative of mine. Huh? There are many relatives. I live with one of the relatives of mine. A mutazabi junantaya abdullahi. A mutazabi junantaya abdullahi. Translation, brother. Are you married? Huh? La, 
Harfuna fi. Lastu, what kind of a sentence is this? In Jumla failure. But what is Laisa? Laisa is minakhwatu kana. Huh? But we will say Laisa, huh? fialun, nakisun, jamidun. Huh? Okay? You will hear from me this all the time, and inshallah, you will feel that you have already memorized it. If lastu comes, the fiel is laisa. Where is the ismu laisa? Tu. Huh? And where is the khabar laisa? Be mutazab region. Huh? Translation? I'm not married. Huh? I'm not married. Ma unwanuka. Unwanu means address. Huh? This is not Urdu word, huh, brother? This is Arabic. Huh? Because unwan is also used in Urdu language. Ma huh? unwanuka. Swali also? Okay. Uh, what is your what is your address? Hadihi eh? bitakati. Brothers and sisters, you should be careful. What did I write here, brother? Bitakatun. How many words are there? No, <laughs> it's one word. <laughs> it's one word. <laughs> B is not harf char. It's part of the word. Are you with me? If it was harf char, then it would become bitakatin. But I said bitakatun. So it is one word. It's not two words. Okay. Now, when you say bitaka ti, then how many words are there? There are two. Muda, mudafili. Adehi muptada, bitaka tu, khabar, wahua muda, ya mutakalam, mutakalam. Full stop. Fiha unwani. What is fiha? Char majur, shibu jumla khabar. Unwani, how many words are there? Two. My address. Unwa nu. And Yamatakalam. So where is your Muptada? Unwanu. Wahua Mudaf and Mudafilehi. Very good, brother. Your business card. Business card. I forgot to tell you. <laughs> business card. Are you with me, brother and sisters? Ashkuraka Yahi. Ashkuruka Yahi. Ashkuruka yaakhi. I thank you, oh my brother. Ashkuruka, ashkuruka. What is the verb? Ashkuru. What is madi? Shakara. What is madi? Shakara. Bab nasara. Shakara, yashkuru. Yashkuru, tashkuru, tashkuru, ashkuru, nashkuru. So when you say ashkuru, how will you define it? Felun. Mudharion, Marfun, Bidamma. Where is the file? Ashkuru, Mustatir, Takadiruhu, Ana. Huh? Fine. What is Ka doing here? Mafulun bihi, brother. Ashkuru is not noun. Ashkuru is verb. If it was a noun, then Ka would be Mudhafili. But here it is Mafulun bihi, Yahi. Ana masroorun, ana mubtada, masroorun khabar. What is the meaning of ana masroorun? I am happy. B, now B is harf char. Lika'i. Isam majroor. Wa huwa mudaf and ka mudafili. B lika'i ka. How many words are there? Three. What is the meaning of B lika'i ka? With meeting you. Uh, by meeting you or with meeting you. Huh? This is a nice sentence you can use in your daily lives. Ana masrurun bilikai ka or if you tell a sister bilikai ki. Or if you tell many brothers bilikai kum. If you tell all the sisters 
Bilikai kunna. Very beautiful sentence. You should memorize it, brother. Ana masurun bilikai ka. Ana saanzilu. Now, okay, brothers and sisters. Nazala. Nazala. Nazala is bab daraba. What is nazala? Nazala, what is the meaning of Nazala? Huh? To get down, to descend, to get down. Huh? Now, brothers and sisters, Nazala, what will be the mudarya? Yanzilu. What will be the mudarya? Yanzilu. Huh? Yanzilu. Okay? So, if it is Yanzilu, then it is uh, Tanzilu, Tanzilu, Anzilu, Nanzilu. Huh? Fine, brother. Now, you know, fail mudharya, brothers and sisters, has the meaning of present and future together. Okay? If I say to you, Azhabu ila suk hazal masa. How will you translate? I go to the mosque. Masa is evening. Huh? Huh? So, it is not evening now. So if you say, Azhabu, Azhabu ila suk hazal masa. I will go. See, Azhabu here gave the meaning of future. But if you want to exclusively say it for future, then you will add seen to the fail mudarya. What will you do? You will add seen. What is it called? Harfu. What will you say in English? Particle of futurity. What will you say? Particle of futurity. Particle of futurity. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Istikbal. Huh? All these things are mentioned in your key. I request you to read it. Keep the key next to your uh, bed, uh, bedside table. And whenever you get chance, read it. Brother. Read it before you go to bed. It will just make your understanding very strong, inshallah. So here, when you use seen with fail modarya, then you make it exclusively for future. So if I say, anasa anzilu, means I will get down. Huh? If you only say anzilu, I'm getting down. Huh? But if you say sa anzilu, then I will get down. So seen makes the fail mudarya exclusively for future. Okay, brothers and sisters. Fil mahtati al kadimati. Mahtati is a station, universal stop or train station stop, which comes. Kadimati means next. Next. Coming. Huh? When you write subway, what does the operator say? Next station. And you get up, get ready for it. Huh? So, al-mahtatul kaadimatu means next station. Al-mahtatul kaadimatu, next station. Huh? Fine, brothers and sisters. What is ana? Muqtada. Where is our khabar? Sa'anzilu, jumla failure. What is seen, you will say, harfu istikbal. Huh? Harfu istikbal. Okay, fine. And, and what will you say? Anzilu, failun, mudariun, 
marfun bi damma where is the five damirun mustatirun taqdiruhu ana are you with me brothers and sisters inshallah fi harf char al mahtati ism majrur al kadimati not remember al mahtati al kadimati not very good here is another beautiful sentence arabic is so rich brother in in uh, in salutations and in giving duas and you know in welcoming people and in many other expressions arabic is very rich abdullah what is the sentence fi ama billah you know most of the people use this word but they do not know that after fi it is ism majrur you will hear them fi aman allah what will you hear but fi aman allah bada it cannot be aman but why harf jar ism majrur so it has to be fi aman allah and not aman allah don't make it mansoor it's majrur fi aman allah huh? how many words are there fi aman allah fi harf char amani ism majrur wa huwa mudaf and allah mudaf ilayhi got the idea now this is a dua okay means may you be in the protection of allah may you remain this is the most beautiful thing brother if you really understand the meaning are you with me fi aman allah may you remain in the protection now may allah protect you okay how long should, should allah protect you ila al likai till we meet again <laughs> brother if i don't meet you for the rest of my life my dua is with you <laughs> may i meet you in jannah <laughs> till that time may allah protect you isn't it beautiful brother huh? Huh? so you say fi amanillah and sometimes when you say fi amanillah the other person will say ila al liqa till we meet again you know i am also giving you a dua that may allah protect you till we meet again huh ila al liqa how many words are there ila al liqa ila al liqa brother two words what are they jar majrur <laughs> they are jar majrur likai means meeting huh al liqa means the meeting ila al liqa are you with me brother this is you can start using this sentence you know fi aman allah ila al liqa may you be in the protection of allah till we meet again maybe tomorrow maybe next week maybe after a month maybe after a year or maybe over there you know <laughs> my dua stays with you <laughs> alhamdulillah it's so beautiful brother if you understand the meaning then we feel it uh, the words they can they can touch you asaiku what is the meaning of asaiku what is the meaning of asaiku the driver the driver huh? the bus operator the ttc person the bus operator now he is li fasalin he is saying to the fasal hazal babu hazal babu what is hada al babu bada <laughs> where is the khabar lid dukhuli lid dukhuli what is lid dukhuli jar majrur shibu jumla khabar what is the meaning of dukhuli for entering dakhala is to enter dukhul is entry huh ya sayyidi what is the meaning of ya sayyidi sir o oh, sir okay an nuzulu what is an nuzulu ha huh? exit exit men hona it is there you know in ttc sometimes the, the bus will say you know get off from the back door ha huh? front door is only for entry 
Okay? Huh? Okay? So this is what the driver is saying. Hazal babu lidduhuli. This uh, door is for entrance. And nuzulu min huna is there. Okay. Now in this lesson we are learning something new. Very new. Very important. Brother. And uh, um, I will tell you briefly now. Huh? Okay. Brother, we have studied verb. Huh? Okay, we have studied verb. Dakhala. What is the meaning of dakhala? He entered. Huh? He entered. And what is the meaning of nazala? He got down. Got down. Huh? What is the meaning of sajada? He prostrated. Are you with me? What is the meaning of raja? He returned. Huh? Now, in English, we have, brothers and sisters, uh, we make nouns uh, by putting ing at the end. Enter, entering. Are you with me? Return, returning. Uh, prostrate, prostrating. Are you with me? But in, in Arabic, we have also nouns which we derive from verbs. Huh? And they are called verbal noun in English. And in Arabic they are called masdar. What are they called? Masdar. What is al-masdar, brother? Verbal noun. No, verbal noun, brother. This is extremely important. Very important, we are learning something new. Huh? When you have verb, there are two things in verb. It denotes action, but the time of action. What the action in the past, or is the action happening now? Huh? In English we call it, it has tense. What does it have? Tense. And also it has a subject. Huh? It has a subject. But in master, brothers and sisters, in master, only the action is mentioned without tense and without subject. Huh? So if I say, Dakhala, he entered. Now, if I form a master out of it, it will become Dukhul. What is the meaning of Dukhul? Entering. But it still has the verb in it. Huh? But no tense, no time, and no doer of action, no subject, no file. Are you with me? And then it is a noun. It will decline. It will have tanween if it is indefinite. If it is definite, it will have a tanween. Okay? So for the first time, now we are learning the master. How to make verbal noun from the verbs. Are you with me? What do we call it in Arabic? Master. In English, verbal noun. Now, brothers and sisters, we have to remember, Arabic is very vast. And there are many forms of master. Uh, so many forms of master that sometimes you can go crazy. Uh, but again, Dr. Abdurrahim, you know, in his vision and farsightedness, he will bring one form at a time. So we just handle one form. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? What is the one form here? Is fu'ulun. What is the wazan? Fu'ulun. What is the pattern? Fu'ulun. That is the form of a master. How you make master from a verb. So, dakhala, dukhulun, nazala, nuzulun, sajada, sujudun. Huh? Are you with me, brother? Huh? Raka'a, ruku'un. It's very easy. Most of them you already know. But you never knew that these are masters and you never knew that it has a pattern. And once you know the pattern, huh? 
it becomes easy. So what is the pattern, brothers and sisters? Fu'ulun. Huh? Now when you will see anything in the Quran on the pattern of Fu'ulun, then you know it is a master. Okay? Now just to tease you, are you with me, brothers and sisters? Just to tease you now, I will give you another form of master. Just to tease you. Huh? <clears throat> Here is another verb, brother. What is it? Here is another verb. Hmm? No, this to have a different form of verb. Master. Master. Huh? What is the form of master for Nasara? Are you with me? What is the form of master? Follow. Huh? You know something? You already know it. But you never realize that you know it. You never realize that you know it. So there are many forms of master. We will be studying one by one. Right now we are studying this form. For Ulun. Huh? But just to tease you, because you already know it, huh? you already know it, so I thought I should tickle you. I should tickle your mind. Huh? Okay, brothers, are you ready? Are you all listening? Iza ja'a. What is after that? What is Nasru? Master. What is Nasru? Master. Nasrullahi. What is Nasrullahi? Mudaf, mudaf ilihi. Are you with me? Iza ja'a. Nasrullahi. Wal. Fathu. Are you with me? Wal. Fathu. Okay. So what is the master from Nasara? Nasrun. And what will be here? Are you with me, brothers and sisters? See, you know it already. Huh? Okay. So if I say to you, Ja'a, what is Ja'a, brother? Fiel Mahdi. Where is the file? Let me write it down. See, now you will watch how the noun ends. It's Fathu. What is Fathu? Marfu. And what is Nasru? Marfu. Huh? Are you with me, brothers and sisters? So, we won't go into Ira now, because that requires further explanation. We'll do in book three. Ja'a is your fail Mahdi. Where is the file, brother? Nasru is your fire. How do you know Nasru is fire? You can see it's Marfu. Huh? Are you with me, brother? So, Nasru is your fire. Huh? No, because verbal noun. It's, it's, it's just like a noun. But it has the meaning of verb. Huh? Helping, help. Helping. Huh? Helping of Allah. Help of Allah. Okay, brothers and sisters. So, Okay? No, this is not part of the lesson, brother, but I'm just trying to tell you. I want to make it interesting by bringing some verses of Quran here and there. Okay, brother, Iza, Ja'a. Iza means when. Uh, ja'a, here, Ja'a will become present tense, not the past tense because of Iza. But that we are going to learn in book three. Translation is when the help of Allah comes. Huh? Ja'a, Nasru, 
It is fa'il wa huwa mudaf and Allahi mudafili. And then there's a wow, ataf. And what is the next one? Al fathu. See, now when you read al fathu, you will say this is marfu. Why it is marfu? Mautufun ala nasru. Is nasru definite and definite? Definite. Definite. <laughs> See, because the mudaf ilahi is definite, so nasru is definite. So if there is a mautufun ala, that has to be definite too. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Huh? Huh? The whole Quran will become more interesting. You will be fascinated by it, inshallah, huh? once we learn the language. So, Nasru is also a verbal noun on the pattern of Fahlun, which we will learn later on. Right now, we are learning the, the pattern of verbal noun, which is Fu'ulun. So, keep that in mind, huh? inshallah. It is coming in the... Uh, okay, let us break for tea now, brothers and sisters. Uh, Fifteen minutes only. And inshallah, we will uh, continue. Brothers, we are back from our break. Ajib anil as'ilatil atiyati. Bi ayyi jamiatin yadrusu abdullahi. What will you say? Yadrusu abdullahi fi jamiatir riyad. Inshallah, you will be able to write down the... I'll be going a little faster now. Fi ayyi kulliyatin yadrusu huwa. Either you say huwa yadrusu or you can even say yadrusu. In that case, it means he studies. Yadrusu fi kulliyatin handasati. Are you with me? Abdullah studies in the faculty of engineering. Fi ayyi kulliyatin. Yadrusu Isa, Yadrusu Isa, fi kulliyati tib. Are you with me? Are you there with me? Fi kulliyati tib, inshallah. What about the next one? Fi ayyi kulliyatin, Yadrusu Ibrahimu, Yadrusu Ibrahimu, fi kulliyati Tijarati, faculty of commerce. Now these sentences are very easy to write and it gives you extra practice, brother. Okay. Fi ayyi kulliyatin yadrusu ishaq yadrusu ishaq fi kulliyatin adabi in the faculty of art. Fi ayyi kulliyatin yadrusu ismailu Yadrusu Ismailu fi kulliyatil ulum in the faculty of sciences. Aina tadrusu akhwatu abdillahi akhwatu abdillahi Are you with me? Fine. How will you answer now? Tadrusu akhwatuhu What will you say? Tadrusu akhwatuhu Huh? Or if you want to make it a short, what will you say? Yadrusna. What will you say? Yadrusna. What is the meaning of Yadrusna? They are studying. Huh? Yadrusna fil madrasatil mutawasitati. They are studying in the middle school. Huh? Or you can, you can say also Yadrusna fi madrasati Khalid ibn al Walid lil banat. Are you with me? You can, all these things are there, inshallah. Yadrusna fi madrasati Khalid ibn al Walid. Lil banat. Fine. Aina yaskunu Abdullahi. What will you say? Yaskunu Abdullahi ma'a karibin. Li is I. Lahu. MashaAllah. Are you with me? We are talking about Abdullah. We are not talking about ourselves. Yaskunu Abdullahi ma karibin lahu. He is staying in one hour. Are you with me? 
Karibin lahu. Okay. Yaskunu Abdullahi Ma'a Karibin. And then you will say Lahu. Sahih? Inshallah. What is the next one, brother? Aina yaskunu ikhwatuhu. You can say simply, yaskununa, means they live. Are you with me? Yaskununa fi mahajil jamiyati. In the dormitories or in the hostels of the university. Fine, brothers and sisters. Sahih. Correct the following. Huh? لا يعرف عبد الله مهندس سلمان. Is this correct? No. no. Then you try to write the answer. You just have to take out لا. What will you say? يعرف عبد الله مهندس سلمان. عبد الله متزوج. What will you say? عبد الله. You got to use لايسا. Laisa bi mutazawi jin. What will you say? Abdullahi Laisa bi mutazawi jin. Very good. Yadrusu Abdullahi fi sanatil ula. Is it correct? No. What will you change sanatil ula into? Sanatis saniyati. Sanatis saniyati. Fine. نزل عبد الله من الحافلة قبل نزول الفيصل. Is it correct? Okay. Here you will say نزل عبد الله من الحافلة بعد. If you just قبل means change it to بعد and it will be done. Okay. ما شاء الله. Now the next uh, question, brothers and sisters, has got nothing to do with the lesson. Aina tadru suanta. What is the translation? No, what is the translation? Where do you study? Adrusu bijamiati Toronto, you can say. Adrusu bijamiati York. You can say. Adrusu bijamiati McMaster. Okay, fine, brother. Aina taskunu. Askunu fi. Askunu fi Richmond Hill, or you can say askunu fi Brampton, fi Brampton, or you can say askunu fi Toronto. Are you with me? Atarifu lugatal Franciata. Atarifu lugatal Franciata. لا أنا لا أعرف. Or you say نعم. أعرفها. لغة اسمها الناس. What will you say? أعرفها. نعم أعرفها. I know it. من أي إزاعة تسمع الأخبار؟ تسمع will change into أسمع. أسمع الأخبار من إزاعة CBC. Or you can say, in London. Huh? Any, anything you want to say, brother and sister. Atarifu baital mudarrisi. Baita is mafulun bihi. Atarifu baital mudarrisi. Okay. Naam. What will you say? Arifu hu. Arifu hu. You can say, arifu baital mudarrisi. But arifu hu will do the job. Okay. Now, brothers and sisters, this is very easy. Abdullahi yadrusu bi jamiyati. See, Abdullahi, then the verb came yadrusu. Wa ikhwatuhu aidan, and then ikhwatu is jama. So it came to yadrusuna. Are you with me? Are you following it, brother? Watch the verb, form of the verb. Wa Akhwatuhu, akhwatuhu, what will happen to them? Yadrusna. 
फिल मदरसतिल मुतवसिता थी जैनबु तदरसु फी सनतिल उला नाउ दिस इज द इंडिकेशन ऑफ हाउ वी विल बी यूजिंग द डिफरेंट फॉर्म्स ऑफ द वर्ब एंड अल्हम्दुलिल्लाह ब्रदर आई कैन से विद कॉन्फिडेंस दैट यू आर ऑल वेरी स्ट्रांग इन दिस नाउ यू गॉट टू पुट प्रॉपर वर्ब फॉर्म बट रिमेंबर रिमेंबर ब्रदर एंड सिस्टर्स ओनली मुदारिया only mudariya huh? here brother to make things very simple and easy uh, dr abdurrahim is asking us to use the mudariya form of zahaba only huh? tamal tamalil amsilata ponder the example and then put in the blank spaces zahaba okay but only mudariya bada al mudariya ha min fi'l zahaba right that's all so abi mudariya bada yazhab abi yazhab ila suki kull sabah every morning at tullab yazhabuna at-tullabu yazhabuna very good al-ana ila al-malabi how will you translate at-tullabu yazhabuna al-ana yazhabuna al-ana ila al-malabi how will you translate students are going to the playground very good ukhti now this is your sister third person ukhti sister brother tazhab ukhti tazhab ila al madrasati translation brother my sister is going to the school now it comes aminatu wa fatimatu wa aishatu what will you say now yes hab because it is hunna aminatu wa fatimatu wa aishatu yazhabna al-ana ila al-maktabati how will you translate brothers and sisters are going to the to the library to the library aina ya ahmadu how will you translate sister manas aina tazhabu ha aina tazhabu anta ya ahmadu how will you translate where are you going o oh, ahmad and how will you do this also sister manas you can do it one more ana azhabu azhabu alana ila almasjid how will you translate i'm going now to the masjid mashallah mashallah now comes the hard test now you have to that was very easy only yazhabu and its different forms now you have to come with the proper words huh, brothers and sisters of different forms qurat al kadami kull masain ha at tullabu At-tullabu yal-abuna. What will you say? Tullabu yal-abuna. Will you be able to write it? Huh? At-tullabu yal-abuna. Are you with me, brother and sister? See, now you have to use your mind and figure out the different forms of verbs. Huh? Al-mudarisu. Very easy. Darsa ala sabura. What will you say, al mudarisu? Yaktubu. Al mudarisu? Yaktubu. Mashaallah. Mashaallah. Now, something with a soap. Something with soap. What do you do? <laughs> so, how will you say? Akhwati yag silna. Akhwati yag silna. Correct, brother and sister. Huh? Kulla sabahin. 
Quran. What do you do with the Quran in the morning? Ana akrau akraul Quran kulla sabahin. Remember, kulla is your zarf here. Brothers and sisters, these are so beautiful sentences. They are such a beautiful sentences. Think about it, write it, and say loudly to yourself. Huh? Say loudly to yourself, inshallah. Huh? Brother, Ya Abdullahi, we are asking Abdullah who is in front of us. What will you say? What do you do with news? Le- uh, so what will you say? You are using only Mudharia, brother. No, but he is in front of you. Tasmau. Atasmau al-akhbar min al kulla yawmin. Ya Abdullahi, translation brother, do you listen to the news every day from the radio? Ya Abdullah, fine brother. Now, atalibatu, remember atalibatu, it's a jama, and it is a third person. Atalibatu ilal madrasati bilhafilatil madrasati. What will you say? Atalibatu yazhabna. Atalibatu yazhabna il madrasati. Biha filatil madrasati. Biha filatil madrasati. Translation, brother? The family students are going to the school by the school bus. By the school bus. Ya Ali. <coughs> Al Azan, what do you do with Azan? You listen, so what will you say? Atasmaul Azan fi Gurfatika. Do you listen to the Azan in your room, O Ali? Fine, brother. Now, Mudarrisa is a Mafulun Bihi. And many questions. So, what, is, what are the Tulabs doing? at what will you say, Sister Manas? What did you say? Asking question. Yes, Aluna. What will you say? at Yes, Aluna. Yes. Atullabu yes aluna. Atullabu yes aluna. Fine, brothers and sisters. An nisau atufaha ya kul ya What will you say? Ya kulna. Two things you can say, brothers and sisters. Kulna means they are eating, or you can say, means they are cutting, cutting the apples. For making fruit salad. Okay? Kata'a, to cut. Yakata'u. Are you with me? This is akala ya kulu and kata'a ya tau to cut. Huh? Okay, brothers and sisters. Al-Mudiratu Min al-Maktabiha From her office Min Takhruju Al-Mudiratu Takhruju Takhruju al-Ana Min Maktabiha Okay Ana Adrusu Very good Ukhti, brother, my sister, duru saha fi daftar. 
What do you do with your lesson? Fi huh? daftar. Right. So what do you say? Ukhti taktubu. Ukhti taktubu. See, brother, and so as I said, this is a very important exercise. It tests your knowledge. Now, do you understand how to use different forms? Hmm? And most of you were able to, except for a few here and there. This is a very important exercise. You've got to write it again on a separate sheet of paper. Write the whole sentences, put the sentences, and read them loudly. And inshallah, you'll become very strong. Now, number six exercise is halwa puri, brother. This is very, very easy. Especially for you, because you have been practicing mudariya. Huh? How will muptada change the muptada in every sentence into jama? Atalibu yadhulul fasla. What will you say now? Atullabu yadhuluna. Huh? See, your mind will say atullabu yadhuluna. Sahi? Yadhuluna al fasla. Arrajlu yakulu. Aruzza, rice. Aruzza is rice. Huh? What will you say? Arrajlu, change it into arrajalu. Yakulunal. Aruz. Are you with me, brother? Aruz. Al amilu, you know the jama of amil? Ummalun. Huh? What is it? Like tullabun, tujarun, ummalun. So what will you say now, brother? Yamalu will become Yamaluna. Yamaluna. Okay. Fil masnaif samani satin. They are working for how many hours? Eight hours. Attajiru will become Atujaru. Yaftahuna. With brother. Dukan means one dukan. Now there are many merchants. Yeah. What is the jama of dukan? Dakakina. Mafulun bihi. At-tujjaru vyaftahuna dakakina fisati thaminati. At-tabibu will become at-tibbau yazhabuna. This is very easy because you are good at your mudari. Alhamdulillah. Ukhti. How will you change ukhti into akhawati? What will be the now mudariya, brother? Yab hasna. Bahasa yab hasu. Yab hasna. Again, every exercise is important. You must do it, inshallah. During the weekend, write it each and every sentence. Sabza, every sentence. Sister Sumaya, Fatima, every sentence. Fine, brother and sister. Al Mudarrisatu. What will you say? Al Mudarrisatu. See, we are talking about third person. Nay. Yadkhulna. Tadkhulu is for Antum. It is for Hunna. Yadkhulna. Al Mudarrisatu. Yadkhulna. Brother, all of them went into one room. Al Fusul. What will you say? Al Fusula. Al Fusula. Fusul. Classrooms. Fisati Saminati. The teachers are entering their the classrooms at eight o'clock. Let us see, brother and sister. At Talibatu Taktubu Darsa. What will you say? At Talibatu Yaktubna, mashallah. That was beautiful. You did it very well. Mashallah. Zamilatu ukhti. Now make it into plural. Zamilatu ukhti. Friends of my sister, colleagues of my sister. Ta'arifu. Ya, ya, ta'arifu, ya'arifna. Arafa, ya'arifu. Ya'arifna, ya'arifna. What will you say? Ya'arifna. 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 Logatal Francia. 
Bintu Ammi. How will you now say? Make it plural. Banatu Ammi. Yadrusna. Yadrusna fil madrasati sanaviyati. Alhamdulillah. You did very well. Now you have to write it so that you become more strong, inshallah. Annis al fa'ila. Now make the file into mournness. See how beautiful these exercises are from different angles and from different, in different ways. Dr. Abdul Rahim is giving us these beautiful exercises so that we can learn how to use the different form of mudariya. Aina yadrusu ahuka. Ya Ali. So what will happen to yadrusu? Aina tadrusu uhtuka. Uhtuka. Third person. Here. Yasharabu abi al kahwa. What will you say? Tashradu ummi al kahwa. MashaAllah. This is easy, brother. Yal abu teflu. Ma uhtihi. Now you got to be careful here. Huh? What will you say? Atiflu will become altiflatu. What will it become? Atiflatu. Yal abu altiflatu ma uhti ha. Ma uhti ha. Are you with me? Now it will change. You will write down. Ma. Ukhti, and you will say ha, because it's the female child. Huh? Is it clear? Does it make sense to you, this sentence? I'm not going forward till you understand. Brother, we got to make the file into mourners. So where was the file before? Yal abu tiflu. Now if you tiflu, that is a Male child. Make it into female child. Teflatu. So what will happen to Yalabu? It will become Talabu. Ma Uhtihi. When it was male child, it was Uhtihi. When it is female child, you will say Ma Uhtiha. Clear, inshallah? Inshallah. Yadhabu Talibu ilal madrasati. Tadhabu. Talibatu, yes. Tazahabu, Talibatu, ilal madrasati. Very good, brother. Aina, Yajalisul mudarisu. Now make it mudaris into Tajalisul mudarisatu. MashaAllah. See, you got a very good idea. Do you feel confident in answering? Alhamdulillah. Huh? Alhamdulillah. With a little practice. Ta'amal ma yali. Ponder the following. Anta tazhabu. Hiya tazhabu. Now, you know, the context of the sentence will tell you whether tazhabu is for anta or whether the tazhabu is for hiya. Huh? So you don't have to worry. It becomes very clear, inshallah. Now, brother, in every sentence, change the verb into mudarya. What is the first sentence? Ana zahabtu ila suki. What will you say? Ana azhabu. Brother, this is all halwa puri. This is very easy, brother. Gasala waladu wajahahu bisaboni. What will you say? Ya gusilu waladu. Khalas, brother. Atullabu kharaju minal fasli. What will you say? Atullabu. Now, yakhruju, brother. Is to yakhrujuna because it is to labu. Huh? You cannot say yakhruju, you'll say yakhrujuna. Huh? Is it clear, no. Sister Sumaya? Inshallah. Bi ayyi jamiatin darasta ya Faisal? In which uh, university did you study? So, how will you change that? Bi ayyi jamiatin. Tadrusu, because you are asking, Faisal is in front of you. Faisal is in front of you. So what you are asking in which university you are studying. Fi ayyi jamiyatin tadrusu. 
يا فيصل اتاليبات دخلنا الفصل اتاليبات يدخلنا الفصل يد خلنا الفصل ما شاء الله very good brothers and sisters لعبت آمنة ما أختها what will you say now brother and sister first we have to find out the verb لعبت يلعب so here it is آمنة is the file تلعب that's how you look come to the right verb لعبت what is لعبت Bab Samia. Brother, if you see Kasra, 99% of the time, you can say, Yal Abu. Huh? Make it 99.9. Okay? Laiba, Laibat will become Tal Abu. Aminatu ma ukhtiha. Katab al mudarisu darsa la saburati. Yaktubul mudarisu darsa la saburati. سألت طلاب المدرسة أسئلة كثيرة سأل يسأل يسأل نزل الركاب من الحافلة ينزل الركاب من الحافلة قالت أمي الثياب تغسل تنرش Tagsilu, do it slowly, slowly. See, brothers and sisters, uh, we tried to do the mudhari a little early so that you are now, inshallah, stronger in your understanding and you are very precise in your answering. But uh, again, if you write it, you will become more strong. Every tamarin in this lesson is important. Every tamarin is important. Do it during the weekend. Huh? Remember now, controlling, mastering the verb will enable you to master the language. So you've got to work hard on verbs, inshallah. And they are beautiful, they are easy, they are fun. Huh? Now, in this number 10, brothers and sisters, we have to do negation. How do you negate Mahdi and how do you negate Mudariya? كتب أحمد درسا. make it درسا. if you have درسو there, make it درسا. مفعولون به. كتب أحمد درسا. how will you negate it now? ما كتب أحمد درسا. يكتب أحمد درسا. how will you say now? لا يكتب أحمد درسا. أنا أشرب الشاي. Ana la ashrabu. What will you say? Ana la ashrabu chai. La ibna qurat al-kadmi al-yawma. Ma la ibna. Are you with me? This is very easy, brother. Inshallah. Abhi yadhabu ila suki kulla yawma. Abhi la yadhabu ila suki kulla yawma. Brother, now you are reading sentences and you are understanding. And inshallah... You are translating it beautifully. Alhamdulillah. Ukhti tadrusu bil jamiyati. Ukhti la tadrusu bil jamiyati. Hafisti suratan nabi ya mariyamu. How will you negate this? Ama hafisti. What will you say? Ama hafisti. Didn't you memorize suratan nabi? نعم بلا تأمل الأمثلة تأمل الأمثلة ثم أجب عن الأسئلة الآتية مستعملا حرف الاستقبال Are you with me? حرف الاستقبال here We are learning now حرف الاستقبال The particle of futurity سيرجيو المدير غدا So what is the meaning of سيرجيو Mudiru, where is the file? Where is the file? File. Mudiru. So what will you, how will you translate, brother? 
not the teacher, brother. The principal will come tomorrow. Will come. Because sa now makes the fail into exclusively for future. Sa zabu ila Makkah. What is the translation? I will go to Makkah. Ba'da isbu'in after a week, inshallah. Fine. Azhabu ilal malabi kulla masain. How will you translate that, brother? Azhabu ilal malabi kulla masain. No, no. I go to. I go to the playground every evening. Now, what you want to say? Sa azhabu. I will go Hazal Masa this evening Ilal Maktabati to the library. Do you see? Sa'adhabu Hazal Masa Ilal Maktabati to the library. We are asking a question to Ali. Mata Yarjiu Abuka Min Baghdada Ya Ali. Translation, brother? When is your father? Returning from Baghdad, O Ali, Sayarjiu Bada Isbu'in. What is the meaning of? He will return. See, now by making seen part of the verb mudarya, you change the meaning into future. Aina Tadhabu Hazal Masa. What will you answer? Sa'adhabu. What will you say? Sa'adhabu Sa'adhabu haza al-masa Ila al-maktabati Or wherever you want to go to Mata taktubu risalata Ila ummika Ya Yunus What will you say? Sa No brother You have to answer now Sa Aktubu Sa Aktubu I will write Sa Aktubu Ilaiha to her, you, say, you can say Hazal Masa or Gadan or whatever you want to say tomorrow. Sa'aktubu ilayha Hazal Masa. Mata taksilu sayarata ya waladu. Sa'agsilu sayarata ba'da qalil. After a little while. Huh? Hallaku. What is it, brother? Hallaku. Barber. Huh? Mata tazhabu ilal hallaki. Ya Hisham. Your, your hair is too long. When are you going huh, to the barber? What will you say? Sa'azhabu huh? ilal hallaki. Adal masa ghadan. Bada is boin. I want still to go grow my hair. <laughs> Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Fi ayyi mahatatin. What is the meaning of fi ayyi mahatatin? In which station? Tanzilu ya sayyidi. Or will you say? Sanzilu ya sanzilu fil mahatatil kadimati. Fil mahatatil Kadimati. Fil mahatatil kadimati. I will get down next station. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Now comes our master on the weapon of fu'ul. Remember, master, verbal noun. It is still denoting an action, okay, but with no tense huh? and no file. Remember I said to you, no, you will read the key, inshallah, very well. And then you will understand. I've got the keys in front of you, all of you. I would like to read it. Remember, sisters? This, this uh, uh, keys written by Dr. Rahim, they are so beautiful. They are worth... It's weight in gold. Okay, brother, I go to page number 39, number 4. The master is the verb. What is it, brother and sisters? The master is the verb minus the tense 
and the subject. Now this is the gist of the whole thing. What is master? Master is a verb. Huh? Page number 39. Number 4. Highlight this, brothers and sisters. Huh? The master is the verb minus the tense and the subject. Do you, do you understand it, inshallah? So, dakhala means he entered. And yadakhulu means he enters. But the dukhul means entry. Okay? The master in Arabic has many patterns. We learn here only one of these. And it is for all we learn. Okay? Dukhulun entry from dakhala. Khuruj kharaja. Huh? And sujood from sajada. And ruku from raka. Okay, jalasa. Julus. Are you with me? Julus means sitting. Okay, and now these are all nouns. And they will decline. Dun, dan, din. Are you with me? And they can also have al to make it make them definite. Eh? The master is a noun, so it takes al and tanmin. Adukhulu mamnu'un. What is the meaning of adukhulu? The entry is forbidden. A ruku kabla sujudi. The ruku is always before sujud. Kharajna min al fasli kabla khurujil mudarrisi. So we came out of the class before teachers exiting. Huh? That's it, brothers and sisters. See how beautifully Dr. Abdurrahim has explained? Inshallah. So you have here some verbs. I'll go quickly, brother. Jalasa yajilisu. What is the master? Julus. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Fine. Nazala yanzilu. Nuzul. Are you with me? Rakiba yarkabu. Ruku. And sajada yasjudu. Sujud. Raka'a yarkau. Ruku. Saida yasadu. Suud. Raja'a yajiu. Ruju. Are you with me, brother and sister? Kataba yaktubu. No, brother, no, no, no. <laughs> you cannot do everything like that. If I say, Zahaba yazabu, Zuhub, no, no. Or Kutub, no, no. They are on a different pattern. And we will learn one by one. So don't try to make <laughs> the <laughs> master out of every verb on the pattern of old. We have to learn them and we have to retain them in our mind. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? So, try to do this and do 13 on your own and we will finish inshallah on Monday and start a new lesson and I would like to show you some new verbs inshallah on Monday. Rabbana atina fi dunya hasanatau wa fil akhirati hasanatau wa kina azab al-nar Rabbana hablana min azwajina wa zuriyatina qurrata ayunin وَجَعَلْنَا لِلْمُتَّقِينَ إِمَامًا رَبَّنَا تَقَبَّلْ مِنَّا إِنَّكَ أَنْتَ سَمِيُّ الْعَلِيمِ وَتُبْ عَلَيْنَا إِنَّكَ أَنْتَ تَوَابُ الرَّحِيمِ سُبْحَانَ رَبِّكَ رَبِّ الْعِزَّةِ يَمَّا يَسِفُونَ وَسَلَامٌ عَلَى الْمُرْسَلِينَ